Good evening, I'm Oteli Edwards. Here are your top stories on News 5. Going to limit gatherings outside of work and schools to 10 persons or fewer. We will close all bars and entertainment venues like nightclubs, discos, cinemas, theatres and karaoke outlets. Under the new measures, all religious services in Singapore will be suspended. Places of worship may remain open for essential rites, but mosques will be closed until further notice. Singapore residents or long-term pass holders who insist on travelling abroad will have to foot full hospital charges if warded for COVID-19. And it's official, the Tokyo Olympics will be delayed for one year after Japan reaches agreement with the IOC. Singapore has announced stricter measures to further minimise the spread of COVID-19. From Friday, all entertainment venues, including nightclubs, cinemas and theatres, will be closed. And while other public venues like malls and attractions may stay open, operators must reduce their operating capacity and groups must not exceed 10 persons. Centre-based tuition and enrichment classes, as well as religious activities, will also be suspended. Singapore residents and long-term pass holders returning from the US and the UK will need to serve their stay-home notices at dedicated hotels instead of at home. The details later on News 5. Well, meantime, mosques in Singapore will remain closed until further notice. Friday prayers will also be suspended. The Islamic Religious Council of Singapore, or MUIS, says this is due to the rising number of COVID-19 cases.